They're honoring and remembering Sergeant Bill Hoosier as tomorrow morning he will be laid to rest. We have team coverage tonight ahead of that funeral service tomorrow. Shelby Lofton is in Orem where tonight the community has come together to line the procession route with ribbons and flags. But let's begin with Dan Rascone who is field anchoring that part of our coverage from Santa Quinn. And Dan, you spoke with Sergeant Hoosier's family tonight. Yes, Debbie, a very tender and emotional scene here at Apple Valley Elementary School where the viewing was taking place. A lot of people coming out here to pay their respects, to be able to honor this man who really did give his life in the service of others. But what was interesting is we talked to the family here tonight. They say that Sergeant Hoosier wasn't even scheduled to be on schedule there that morning. He was actually filling in for another officer when he gave his life in the service of others. You know, this day is tough. He died doing a, a job that, that he loved. This is the toughest thing I've ever had to do. I mean, Bill was a cop, but he was one of my best friends. I will miss him so much. Sorry. This has been terrible for our family. Our hearts are shattered. It's going to be a hard one to get past, for sure. The things that made Bill a wonderful cop, a wonderful police officer, also made him a wonderful human being. And that's who we're grieving today. He leaves behind two beautiful daughters, a granddaughter, a wife, brothers, sisters. I think one of the words that we could all use to sum up Bill is passion. He was so passionate about everything that he did, everything that he did. Unfortunately, he died doing what he, what he loved to do. I mean, Bill wasn't even scheduled to be on that morning. He was covered for another, another officer. Bill was bigger than life, and the tribute that he's getting here is amazing. Each grade has something to say, and it's written on the walls, and it's, it tears your heartstrings to see it. Most of these kids don't even know him but they've all got something very special to say. And he put out nothing but kindness and love to all of us, and we're not sure how we move on without him. We've never had to deal with this before, so we'll just gonna take it one step at a time. And Bill left behind love, and it makes, I hope, everybody want to put more love out into the world. A good message there, and it's quite the tribute from the family there. Now, what's interesting here is Sergeant Bill Hoosier didn't even become an officer until he was in his 40s. It shows for the family, they say they have a whole new respect for the men and women in blue.